All right. There it goes. Bye bye. So, see from the last clip, I just sold the coupe, and this is what I got now. It's a 90, 96? It's a 90 something. But it's a little hard to press. But it is a 90. 96. <laughs> I think this thing's out of battery. Yeah, it's a 96. No. Still a manual window. Sorry, sorry. Still a manual window. But it's not bad. So uh, it came with a detachable steering wheel, which I don't like. Um, it has a manual CTR, uh, not sorry, a manual CRV cluster, which is pretty cool. The gas needle's broken, obviously, but uh, I think you just pull it out, put a new one in. Five speed. As you can see from the shifter, you could kind of tell what it is. It came with like a radio, one of those uh, head units. Pretty tight, pretty tight. It's manually, you gotta open it and close it. It doesn't automatically, it doesn't automatically open on its own. You gotta pull it in. Let's jump down to OV1. Uh, they painted the dash black. The dash, is, the dash is painted black. No carpets. So believe it or not, these are the floor mats off my uh, old Honda Pilot. See, <laughs> and they kind of fit. I had to cut it a little bit to, like, get them to fit better. But they'll do for now until I find uh, a carpet for it. Uh, well, they're probably still gonna be there, but you know, I still need carpet pretty complete in the back missing the cargo cover seats are there same thing back is the the second row of the pilot floor mat that i cut to fit i have an extra one so it's fine uh headliner is peeled off so just that this actually works hello yeah but let's, let's see came with so it came with a door panel, but I threw it away. I threw it away because uh, it was trash. The back looked like this. I don't, I don't, I don't like that. I like this, but I don't like that. So I'm looking for a stock bumper. Uh, the lip, uh, I don't like the lip, so that's gone. Well, I have someone buying it. Spoon. This is a real spoon. I think no, it's like a lot. Spoon wrap, carbon fiber, slip streams, 15 inch, rear disc brakes. Uh, 5% tent, but tent was, he said it was cheap tent, so 99 front end. 99 front, CTR style grill, I think, or spoon, whatever. Uh, Mugen lip, fog lights. They, he had them wired up, but I took it off. I didn't like it. Right here, the wires. I need to clean this. I know, I know. But here's all the wires for the headlights. Oh, sorry, the fog lights. Also the headlights for uh, HID, so I pulled them off. I ordered some uh, LEDs. Hopefully they come in by Wednesday. Um, yeah, not bad. This password, JDM, whatever, bumper thingy. 
one of the homies came yesterday and uh he gave me the the little the actual circle thing that goes on there so i'll wait till i take that off to put it on he told me the clean title and what? <clears throat> okay with ls swap full ls header no cap so it's like a muffler all the way back uh hotter intake basically stock like you can see all these like i don't know how long they'll last but it looks like they're gonna pop soon so i'll probably swap that out uh motor mounts i think they look like ebay motor mount but they, they're good they fucking vibrate like shit tns super street so the basic tns coilovers skunk to manifold uh, it's a g-star throttle body which is pretty pretty cool g-star throttle body two uh aftermarket wires two stock spark plug wires uh stainless steel brake line or clutch line that's ls b18b1 with a a four-door integra uh, ls tranny yeah, she preppy she peppy but oh and these so this vibrates and then so i already started working on it yesterday i i lowered it a little bit in the rear because it's a little too high so i lowered the rear a little bit i fixed the the lower control arm bolts it was sticking out so i just tightened it back in i the the third brake light on the bumper wasn't wired up so i wired it up i will be getting a new bumper though i, I don't like those srt holes and then i will be getting a new front bumper also because i don't like the fog light i want the the stock lip or <clears throat> i want the stock bumper with just a lip i don't know what lip i want yet but i want uh i want those holes uncut and then uh, probably new headlights because these are kind of bad but i think they're oem though so maybe i'll just clean them are they OEM? yeah they're oem oem honda yeah so maybe i'll just clean them but they are clean yeah but i don't like i don't like these so these are coming off the mega lip is actually not bad but uh, i like either the si the si lip if i can find one if not you know so i picked up the car for 2920 um it's registered until december it needs smog so you know you know what i'm gonna do but uh my goal for this is well first things first i gotta get it running you know right and it drives fine the only thing is it pulls to the right like crazy so i know it's gonna need an alignment um and on the transmission it's leaking because of the i think they call it the shift the shift something i can't let me get my jack hold on all right so i jacked up the car instead took the wheel off but i put a i didn't put a jack but i put the wheel in there so it's leaking from this right here the shift shaft shifter shafting this right there that so there's a seal inside there that you have to take out the bitch pin and then uh you just like wiggle it out and then you put the new one in yeah but it's leaking from there no oil leak from anywhere else and uh, yeah so i did so this is from one night right here that's from one night so yeah today is what labor day is it labor day labor day so it's not the shops not or stock the honda's not open so i couldn't go get it but i'm gonna drain whatever fluid i have left in there just so i can save it because I, I did put 3.5 quarts for that reason but i'm gonna drain it and save whatever i can but yeah Good. i'm gonna put that apart yeah that's about it it's not bad 29 
2920. But uh, yeah, just a little quick little update. Little flurry. There it is. But uh, yep, yeah. it's not bad. It's peppy, but it's not quick. But yeah, see you guys later or whatever I do.